A watch inspired by car racing? Let's have a closer look. Dave Taylor here, and I'm looking at this. This is the Casio Edifice EQS 800 CPV1AV. They're not gonna win any awards with naming, but this is a really nice watch. So, what's really cool about it, I'm gonna just start right out, is it actually has a carbon fiber dial. It's the first one Casio has ever made. And the design itself is absolutely inspired by motorsports and car racing. As you can see in this close-up, it's just a really cool looking watch. Now, let me tell you about it, because it's solar powered, has a date display, which I like, and it's 100 meter water resistant, which means that you can wear this diving, you can certainly wear this surfing or at the pool, you can have this on, in the shower, although I take my watches off before I shower, possibly TMI, <laughs> but it's certainly not gonna affect this watch in any way. Like I said, the dial itself is carbon fiber and it's just a really neat watch. Um, the band and clasp is also kind of interesting. So if you're used to ones where they lay flat, this one doesn't. As you can see, there's no lay flat about it. It is a curved, sort of a rubberized um, band. And what's interesting is at the end of it, there's a little sort of lump sticking out so that when you put it through the clasp and then you put it through the little extra buckle, it actually stays locked in. So it's not, um, a lot of watches, this part that floats, the extra little band can just pop off and then your watch ends up looking like that, a little dorky. This doesn't have that problem. This works really nicely. Now, if you look at this close up, you can see that in addition to the large face, it also has three small dials. And starting at the three o'clock position, let me go ahead and put this watch back on, easy enough. Put it on, slip it through the band, and we're good to go. Now, the smallest dial at the three o'clock position is 24 hour time, just in case you wake up and you're not sure, is it 2 a.m. or 2 p.m.? Because I don't know, you don't have windows or something. <laughs> um, the second and third small faces are for the timer. So the one at six o'clock, that small dial is the seconds, so it's a sweep second hand. And then the nine o'clock position dial actually shows accumulated minutes. How do you do timing? It's super easy. There's two buttons on the outside. The top one is start and stop timing. And when it's stopped, the lower one actually resets you back to zero. That's it, super easy, easy way to time things. This is not gonna give you fractions of a second. It's not designed for that. This is just a nice, easy way to say, oh, it looks like I'm at 30 minutes on my parking spot, things like that, right? Super nice. Now, not much else to talk about. This is just a really handsome watch. There's a lot I really like about this. I already am very clearly a fan of Casio. I have a bunch of Casio watches, but this is just another example of how they are taking just a straight chronograph sort of design and they're making it really cool. And the all black with the red highlights, very much motorsports. This is very much the kind of thing I would expect, like someone driving a supercar would have this watch, if in fact they didn't have like a $50,000 watch, but I don't review $50,000 watches, unless you wanna send me one, which I will not complain about. <laughs> so, let me tell you about the price, but let me also ask if you can click on that little floating subscribe button so you can subscribe to my channel, super cool. And hey, do you wear a watch? Tell me in the comments if you wear a watch, why you wear a watch, what kind of watch you wear, and if you don't wear a watch, how do you know what time it is? Oh, crazy, I know, I know, smartphones. But seriously, you pull out your smartphone every time to see what time it is? It's a little clumsy, a watch is much more sophisticated. <laughs> anyway, the pricing on this is actually pretty interesting because this is the Cadio, <laughs> Cadio, hello, Casio Edifice EQS 800 CPB 1AV. Whew, I'm never gonna say that name again. That's what this is. And if you get it at shopcasio.com, it's $170. But with just a couple of minutes of Google search, I found at jcpenny.com, this watch is $122.40. That's a pretty screaming deal. That's almost 50% off. Well, 40, 35% off, somewhere around there. It's a really heck of a good deal. So jcpenny.com, so you can get this for 170 through Casio or do a little comparison shopping and you might well be able to find it less expensive. This is a definite keeper. If you're a watch fan, and even if you're not or you know someone that's into motorsports, 
sports or driving or racing or NASCAR or anything like that, this is going to become their favorite watch. So I say check it out. This is Dave Taylor. I'm back to the races and I'll catch you in the next video.